give it right back. I feel like on Wednesday here between Austin and the G League Ignite, we saw quite a few guys receive a pass. They took their eyes off of it before securing it, and then next thing they knew, the ball was in row one. Confident stroke to be defended. These teams met three times during the winter showcase as ultimately Austin took two of those three meetings, including the only meeting here back in November. But again, those wins and losses do not carry over. As of last year, a new format for the league. Basically two different seasons. I mentioned earlier in the quarter that the 16 points off turnovers by Birmingham were the difference in this game. Spurs have come streaming back. They have 15 points off turnovers now. Oh, can shut off the defender with his left arm and finish with the right hand. And that's just some good fortune. We are level at 51. A five on four opportunity here for Birmingham. There's your odd man to your advantage. Tim, what adjustments need to be made going into the second half? He said turnovers. That was key. He said he was pleased with his team moving the ball. He said and playing with San Antonio. <laughs> yeah, Blake Ahern, uh, now a member of the Memphis Grizzlies organization as an assistant coach. Had a lot of fun down here, and he's one of the guys that really told me it's not really about wins and losses, but getting these guys better jobs. Yeah, with him. Kyer can't make Birmingham pay on that one. Still three-point lead for the squadron. I think that's a little less common these days because you don't want to draw a flagrant either. Eight points. Gave that to a teammate. Oh, and just a breakdown from Austin. Shondi Brown with the offensive rebound. Forced it back up. And it's still a 10-point deficit for Austin. Shondi's first shot and obviously not on the scoreboard yet. Somebody who averages 15 points per game. You'd think that he'd try and find a little bit more of a rhythm coming off of the bench in his first game in a little while. A good body can tell that they're really playing hard for that win tonight. Spurs still guilty of forcing that ball into congestion. And a numbers game adaptation, mind you, which would be a suspension, but in this particular case, uh, just add an insult. Dangorowski connects on the triple. Well, they, Spurs now with 12 made threes. They got the stop, they got the score. Now they got to get another stop, and then momentum will be squarely in Austin's hands to try and close this out on a run to force overtime. Jordan Hall will note three rebounds shy of a triple-double. Keelan Martin. Shot by swing, and it was a big shot. Changes the way that the fouling game probably starts. And Pet